Yeah! Hola gang, and welcome again to Old Nerd Reviews. I'm Tony, I'm your old nerd of the day, and I try things so you don't have to. Today, I'm at Del Taco to try their guacamole fish taco. Not sure exactly what this has on it. Um, their beer battered fish taco was on the website, but the guacamole one didn't have a description. So I'm going off the beer battered one. What this has on it is where it contains is hand cut Alaskan Pollock filet in a crispy beer batter topped with crunchy cabbage, savory secret sauce, and handmade pico de gallo wrapped in two warm corn tortillas and served with a fresh cut lime wedge. I don't know if the guacamole is exactly that or a variation of it, but we're going to find out. Now let me tell you a little story. Not a big fan of Del Taco the first time I tried them. I've only tried them once and they scared me away because what I got was not good. One of the very few times I actually returned an item and asked for a refund because it, it actually, I hate to say this, but it actually looked and tasted very close to what I believe dog food would be. And that's saying a lot for me because I'm pretty tolerant of a lot of stuff, but this was just bad. So they kind of scared me away from ever trying them again, but I'm here to do it for you guys. Del Taco right there. Sun is shining bright today. It's very warm. Okay, here is what the guacamole fish taco comes in aluminum foil wrapper and it does have the lime wedge with it as you can see right there and actually I'm not a big fan well I mean I don't mind lime depends on what I have it on fish is a good thing to have it on so I may try it okay let me see if I can get this unwrapped for you okay there's what it looks like let's try and open it up and see two corn tortillas in there and there is the fish. Okay, so put it back together and let's try this out. Not a big fan. Um, the flour tortilla or the corn tortilla is just a corn tortilla. It's not like grilled or anything, so it's just kind of like straight out of the package, just kind of there. Um, the fish has no crunch to it whatsoever. It's fairly soggy. Um, you've got a bite of the guacamole going on. The cabbage is crisp, which is nice. If there is a secret sauce, I have no idea what it tastes like because of the spiciness of the fish and the guacamole. It's on the smallish side. Uh, in my opinion, not worth the price I paid for it. The fish is fish only because they say it is. Um, doesn't have a nice fish taste to it like it like the fish at the um, Chevron that I did for the recent eating the deli stores. Now that had a really nice fish taste to it because it's fish. This it's fish because I say it is, not because I know it is. Let me try it by itself. It's a solid and somewhat mushy substance um, and it's it's got that bite on it um, and it's more than likely on the breading as well as because of the guacamole but I can't tell this is fish if you told me this was a very tender piece of chicken I may believe you this thing cost me two dollars and sixty cents I'm not gonna finish this I don't like it um, on the Nerdometer, the guacamole fish taco from Del Taco, um, it's edible. I would give this a, I would give this a high, it sucks. Wow. It really doesn't surprise me because of my last experience with, um, with Del Taco. I won't be coming back. Ugh. So I can't recommend it. I wouldn't recommend it. I recommend you avoid it. There you go, gang, another review in the bag. Thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Give this video a thumbs up. 
join me over on Facebook at facebook.com forward slash old nerd reviews and become a part of the old nerd crony community over on Twitter at old nerd reviews and over on the website at oldnerdreviews.com. You guys have a freaking awesome day and I'll talk to you later. Bye now. Thank you.